Yeah, got a show for y'all. Got a damn good show. All right, so Kevin Garnett. Got a damn good show. So Kevin Garnett. He's one of my favorite basketball players, man. Yeah, I like Kevin Garnett. And uh, Paul Pierce it was, it was having a conversation. Yeah. Just talking about I love back in the days, man, them Celtics, man. I was pulling for them, man, but they couldn't pull out their second championship. Them damn Lakers, man. Them damn liberal fools beat them. <laughs> liberal ass city. Well, so is Boston. Yeah, you're right. Shut up. Anyway, <laughs> they got to talk about LeBron James and his son. And um, what did he say? Kevin Garnett called LeBron James out. What, are you talking shit about his son? No, man. He said he was talking about his son. Yeah, just talking about his son. And, but man, shut up. Let's go to video. Yeah. Bron, Bron, uh, Bron to get a uh, bucket on Bron right now? Yeah, he can get a bucket on no Bron right now. Hey, hold yeah, he can up, get a bucket. No way. Why do they nope. look like they Bron? Nah, he can get a bucket on Bron. Bron averaging right 25. <laughs> no, I didn't Bron say he like ain't. I don't care what he's doing, but he ain't sliding, playing at that Shit. all defensive level. 25? Like. Nah, nah. Lord, 25? You still, Lord, he dunking? He's still dunking the ball with. I'm saying that Bronny can get a bucket on Bron. I'm saying he can't. One rollout, get a bucket. Three dribbles? No way. You, I'm yeah, talking about. He can get a bucket on No, 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 no. Man, he, man, come on. That little dude explosive, bro. He is, he but you Bron. seen his dad? His dad on that Balco. Yeah, he, he on that new he juice. He's sliding like he used to, <laughs> bro. Remember Balco? Yeah. <laughs> Making all them steroids you couldn't detect? Right. And all these athletes was breaking records and. Yeah. Um, but why are they looking like they blind blues singers? <laughs> are they singing the blues after the show? They look like two blind blues singers <laughs> that talk <laughs> about basketball. Hey. Yeah, everybody knows with any common sense that LeBron James is juice. You don't perform at that level. How old is age. LeBron? I don't know. Look it up. I think he's 39, 40. He's 38. Yeah, you don't play at that level at 38. This dude's getting better as he age. <laughs> He's what? got that same. No, he's not getting better. He's maintaining. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You see Kareem, what he looked like at that age? <laughs> Before creatine, right? Before creatine. <laughs> he's like an old <laughs> handicapped man <laughs> running down the court. <laughs> Doing that sky hook. <laughs> no, but I think, um, like, I'm, I'm going to be, what, 50? Yeah, I'm going to be 50. My damn body is betraying me. Like when I was 30, like when I started fitness on YouTube, we were what, 34? Yeah. 34. Right? Mm -hmm. But even when I started then, I was still a shell of myself when I was like 25. Yeah. But LeBron, I mean, these are the best basketball players in the world. And it's still got all of those damn miles on them legs. You know how many miles he got on them legs? You know how long he's been in the NBA, right? Yeah, since he was 18. And he's still galloping up and down the court. <laughs> Like ain't shit wrong. <laughs> <laughs> well, he does take a lot of nights off. How many miles do you think he got? That damn warranty is out. Yeah. He put a new engine in there or something. Same thing with Barry Bonds, man. You have to put an asterisk beside his name, scoring leader. Well, I think if, they, uh, if you're a professional out there, you should be able to take stuff. Yeah, but the thing is... I think he should be able to do that. But Yeah, I, I do too. But is all the other players going to do that? He has an advantage over other players. Barry Bonds had an advantage. Even though he was, they're great players, but the steroids performance enhancer is going to extend your career. It's going to make you play at a high level for a longer period of time, and you'll be able to, you know, crash everybody's records. Do they even test the NBA for uh, steroids? Uh, they don't test for that. You know what, Keith? I don't think so. Mm -mm. They don't test for that. They don't test. They don't test. They don't test for tea, growth, marijuana. You, I can tell. Some sometimes them players they high because they didn't used court. to test the uh, major league baseball, and then <laughs> we well, had to. These people's hitting a hundred home runs. <laughs> They're hitting a hundred home runs a month. Yeah, that shit was crazy. Sammy Sosa, Mark McGuire, then Barry Bonds. That was un. That was unreal. And you had three players doing it. Doing that. At the same time, that never occurred. Yeah, per, per the NBA Player Association's collective bargaining agreement with the league, players are subjected to random urine tests a maximum of four times during the season and twice in the offseason. What do they test for? I mean, what do they test for? Does it, do that test PEDs? Uh, Tristan Top, what the hell? According to NBA National, man, uh, players are usually subject to, man. <laughs> <laughs> 
it's like they don't want to give you the information. <laughs> yeah. What do they test for? He, do that come up? He's on growth or something. The NBA will begin testing players for human growth hormone. The league announced Thursday. Yes, 2015. Testing will begin next season, and players will be subject to three random un unannounced tests each year, in addition to reasonable cause testing. Yeah, I bet you they tell them when they're going to test them. And you know what? To test somebody for growth hormone, that's when you inject that. It only peaks for a certain amount of time, and then it's, you go back to normal. What? You can't really detect that. You can't really detect testosterone. Well, you can test how high your levels are. Yeah, but if you test in the normal range, they can't touch you. You could be in an upper high normal, and they can't touch you. They're not giving you the, the circumstances where someone would test positive for, for elevated testosterone. Yeah, being real vague. Yeah, to be real vague about it. Oh, so they test for it. Okay. They test and make sure you under this amount. Yeah. Y'all can go up a hill. Don't go up here. I'm up to, I'm up to say you're positive. <laughs> yeah, but LeBron, man, he's definitely taking some. You think so? Hell yeah. That Just dude. look at the level he, he's playing at physically. He should have broke both his ankles. His <laughs> knees should be shot. He should have two hip replacements right now. This dude run around like he like he's 18 years old. Yeah, like Kobe was a... Uh... Like when Kobe got older, he he snapped his Achilles tendon like just making a move. Mm -hmm. His legs said, "Man, you too old for this shit," and snapped on him. Let me tell you right now, these players coming back from these Achilles uh, tears, uh, like Kevin Durant. Oh, he's on something. Back in the day when we was growing up, when Larry Bird and Jordan was playing, man, that Achilles tear your Achilles. Remember Jordan when he was playing at that age that LeBron is at? Yeah, it's like night and day. I mean, Jordan was still Jordan, but he no, nah, he was he, he wasn't Jordan, Jordan. He wasn't that 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 tongue hanging out, Jordan. <laughs> Licking everybody as he go to the hole. He wasn't that Jordan. He was still good though. Like when you look at professional boxing, you seen when Tyson came on the scene when he was young. Yeah. And then as he got older and it just it wasn't the same fighter. Right. But maybe LeBron's an anomaly. He's just a he's King James. No, he's juiced. He's juiced. He's juiced. You got any proof of that? My eyes. <laughs> Barry Bonds. My eyes. Yeah. How do you go from a damn a line drive hitter, a doubles hitter, a triples hitter, somebody hit line drives? Well, he said about 20 homers a year, Barry Bonds, yeah. Man, don't you cut me off. No, he wasn't no triples and doubles hitter. What are you talking he was about? A, he, was a, he was a home run hitter, but I I remember when Barry first came to the um the baseball. He would hit a lot of doubles in the gap, right? Yeah. I mean, he was a power hitter, but he wasn't a home run hitter. He was a slugger. Well, he hit about 20 homers a year. Yeah, 20, 25 on a good year, 30. <laughs> that dude was coming in, hit 400, bat 400, <laughs> and then hit like like uh, 85 homers a year. Yeah. That's just crazy as hell. And then they hit, he hit the home run. It's so far, everybody's like, damn. <laughs> I ain't never seen the ball go that far. <laughs> yeah. He was a great player, but, you know, still was put you on Well, the LeBron, LeBron James has always been a great player. He's so always, yeah. you think, because he's, I thought he was old. I thought he was like 39. He should have retired a long time ago. Why are you going to retire all that money you're making? No, you're missing my point. The reason why he hasn't retired because he can still perform. No, well, he's always taking care of his body. I don't give a shit what he's doing with his body. If you ain't taking the right vitamins and minerals, <laughs> I don't care what you eat. That dude is on something more than vitamins and minerals. <laughs> you think that dude's taking a smoothie every day? Yeah, yeah. That's why he's performing Yeah, like he's that? taking a greens drink every day. That dude's doing this. That dude doing Oh, I can feel the power coming back. That's what he doing. Think so? Hell yeah. Are you crazy? <laughs> that damn good show. Kevin just hating everybody. No, I ain't hating that dude's Kevin on hate. juice. Kevin hating. That dude's on vitamin T. Hey, that was a damn good show. Hey, we've got a new giveaway going. We're giving away a Ford F-250. That's a powerful truck. Very powerful. <laughs> you get $10,000 in cash with the truck. Then the win. Go to fishhogstwins.com. Anything you buy from the site, get you automatically in the win. Yeah.